All right, what's up, Hawk Squad? Welcome back. So it's now time for another Blade Bar recap, and this is his recap for Creed 2, and it's called When Creed and Drago T Turn Turns Train CTE as Rocket Watches. So Hawk Squad, without further ado, it's now finally time for another banger Blade Boy recap. So Hawk Squad, let's check it out. It's going to be a long one, too, about almost 30 minutes, I believe. So let's go check it out. So before we get into the boxing, let me provide some important context for those who need it. This is Adonis Creed. He's the heavyweight champ of the world. The Mike Tyson of this universe, if you will. Except he can read and speak properly. His father, Apollo Creed, was killed in a boxing match in Creed 4 versus goddamn Russian Captain America, Ivan Drago. So when Creed is offered a fight from Ivan Drago to fight his son, Victor Drago, he of course accepts it. Oh, by the way, if you've not seen the Borderlands trailer, he's playing Craig. But the thing is, Creed's trainer is Rocky, and Rocky was of course there to see his best Damn. friend's head get dribbled like a basketball yep. and sent to lay with Fetty Wap's career. Damn. And he still regrets not throwing in the towel that day, so he tells Adonis, listen, if you take this fight, I can't support Wait, the jungle is gonna have a kill streak on the crazy if you take this fight. For you, I won't be in your corner for it. Hmm. Adonis is like, okay, okay, <laughs> and goes in there by himself without his legendary trainer. So we see Creed walking into the <laughs> arena while Drog was already in there, and oh my Jesus, this man is an 8 footer, 500 pounds. Bro is the wrong warrior. <laughs> Steph Curry need a new power forward, put the gloves down and get on the court. <laughs> so now we see the champ making his entrance into the ring. The Drog. Oh, I also forgot to mention he played Razor Fist and Shang Chi in the Legends Ten Rings. Was already in there looking like they ready to unleash straight slurs. Adonis made sure to put his girl in the front row, but based on her face, it looked like she got zero faith in this man. Rocky's back at his restaurant, and the PTSD is busting his ass. He catching flashbacks, and the fight didn't even start yet. Bro had to look away. But just because you look away doesn't mean it'll disappear. It's go time, as the ref gives a few words to the fighters before the match. Good luck, my nigga. You find a super soldier. It's <laughs> rest. Are you sure you're human, bro? <laughs> Rocky couldn't help himself, though. He ended up walking back to the TV. It's time to coach it up through the screen. Rocky moving like that one homie who dies first in Warzone and starts <laughs> shouting call us through the mic. I touch gloves. Creed, don't break your shits on his. That boy got cinder blocks for fists. But Adonis is refusing to touch gloves with Drago, just giving him the death stare. Drago's confused, like, yeah. hey, what is it fuck me for? I wasn't the one that killed your pops. Fuck wrong with you, nigga. <laughs> go back to their respective corners to get one last talk in with their coaches before the fight starts. Rocky not here, and I don't usually do this, but uh, go out there and hoop, you know? Um, have movement, all that shit. Good luck, bro. Now that's this was ass. More than enough to make anyone converted by I have a dream go back to being racist. But it don't matter, because now it's go time. Time to avenge Pops. So Creed starts it off with... R.I.P. to the Dragon Ball creator, Akira Tokuyami, after I pronounced the last name right. I've heard the recent news, man. It's tragic. Some light jacks, you know? Just trying to feel his opponent out. I think I peeped Adonis get on his tippy toes to throw one of those jabs at the head, but he's just trying to control the ring. And even though he's in the corner, Rocky just can't help himself. Oh man, you might have to punch him in the dick. Creed that <laughs> has just put together a pretty solid combo. One thing to keep in mind is that Donnie's the people's champ because they're in America. These motherfuckers still haven't let go of that Cold War beef. So the announcers are dead riding as Adonis does a nice one-two. And it got the crowd geeking. Drago got his hands down like defenders guarding Westbrook. So Donnie jabs into another left, right, and a rib shot. But Drago's just like... Definitely concerns me a little bit, you know what I mean? But, you know, I, I packed that thing too. So he come around this way, he will get caught. <laughs> oh... Nah. Damn. Right there, he should have known it was Jeez. over. He perfectly blocked the punch and still got set moonwalking <laughs> into the ropes. That shit weak. That's what you got. What are you saying? <laughs> Now's not the time to be talking shit. Creed then throws two more jabs, but Adonis is getting in his feelings and it got him fighting with no tactics. Everyone watching the fight knows he won't last long fighting like that. Good thing I still got the number to the hospital. <laughs> Look at this wild ass swing. I think the stretcher should be able to pull right in there. But this is where Creed is starting to run out of ideas and it's obvious. He throws the same left, right, left twice and gets punched with Ooh. a disgusting left. Bro got rocked so hard he thought his ass was an etch-a-sketch trying to shake that bitch <laughs> away. Everybody in the crowd got silent as hell like this at KSI concert. Damn. Even Rocky had to take a step back. He felt that bitch through the screen. Michael B. Jordan should have learned his lesson. He tried this revenge shit once already, <laughs> and it got him shit <laughs> 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 and gets punished. Look at his face. Is them tears, bro? <laughs> this is again. 
Oof. Yo, somebody coach him up. He needs some advice. Wait, fuck, that's me. <laughs> Usually they say a man competing in front of his girl is unstoppable, but I guess he's the exception to the rule because he continues to get embarrassed. Got his girl in the stands looking like she deciding which couch he's gonna sleep on tonight already. <laughs> My boy's so discombobulated, he in there hitting football moves, trying to mm. juke his way out of this ass whooping. We 20 seconds into this fight right now. Creed is getting pieced up, his girl is thinking about her work boyfriend right now, and his coach is speaking Swahili, not helping at all. And like I said, he's running out of ideas, so he just starts throwing jabs, pacing around the ring. Look at the way he's wincing, trying to even throw a punch. That boy Drago got yeah, him well, in hell. What got your in the place is this? <laughs> hey, isn't that your husband in there? I don't know that nigga. We pan back and he's in there getting combo with crazy. Generational ass seedings is nuts. The cameraman putting this bitch in first person got me behind the shoe blocking, trying to not get hit by those haymakers. It got to the point where he's not even defending himself anymore. He's saved by the bell. And this really got me crying, bro. Cause the ref interjected to make sure that neither of them try to hit each other. <laughs> Never get dog, shoulder, man. right? But look at his face. Why is bro so tight? Creed definitely fucking up his parlay. In all of his 28 fights, Creed has never seen anything like this man before. And it got him so swooped, the round is over, he's walking back to his corner, and he's checking behind him while doing it. Don't worry, bro, he's not coming after you. All the Adonis Creed fans feeling the pain the Warriors fans felt after blowing that 3-1 lead. This girl has to take a seat and a deep breath. She can't handle this anymore. Even Rocky can't believe what he's seen. Bro started checking behind the counter to go find himself a drink. So Creed's in his corner, and while his trainer is giving him advice on how to fight better, he starts <laughs> raging at bro. Like, damn, what the fuck? I'm trying to help you, bro. I Meanwhile, <laughs> Drago's in the corner with Ivan Drago, and he's asking him, why is Adonis still even <laughs> able to stand up right now? Break shit. This man is really just pure evil, bro. I know boxing is a combat sport, but why the fuck you moving like a bad Ooh. villain? Break time is over now, though. They both get up. Everybody's rooting for him. The crowd is absolutely roaring. He weaves the first team maker, and that's what I'm talking about. That was clean foot Oof. movement. Keep it up. You better be in this whole moving like fucking happy feet. Drago connects and misses. Creed's jab gets countered, but then he ducks and jabs again. In the first round, they were a bit passive, but this round, they came out swinging a lot more. Creed weaving, returning with a right left, and gets stopped into the ropes. It's not looking good for Adonis, and his coach is on the sideline <laughs> talking about some, What should he do? I don't know. What you asking us for, you Dora the Explorer ass nigga? You're the coach. Creed is getting held down in the ropes and gets hit with a nasty double left followed by a right hook. And Creed can't even take advantage of the power of friendship or none. Because if he look over, he gonna see his coach looking like these, and his girl <laughs> and the crowd have gone mild. Adonis could have really used some of that Naruto main character sauce. I need that plot number. I like it. Cause he's in the corner right now, swings and gets bopped. Tried to clinch, but Drago's like, get off me. Get back on those ropes and watch this goddamn combo. Creed gets blocked, blocked two, but eats the third uppercut. Straight CTE, but I know he's really confident, so he's probably in his mind thinking like, <laughs> eating another three-piece combo into an uppercut. Get off me. <clears throat> Donnie manages to get off the ropes and stumble his way into the middle of the ring, where they both actually throw jabs, and Creed throws a left-right that gets countered, knocking him into the ropes again. Me and Everybody's rooting for him, and they got them all divided right now on how he should handle this fight. Come on, kid. <laughs> get up and fight. Play that, baby. Play that. Victor only had four fights up until this point with a 3 and one record, but he still got the champ slumped over. His dad's <laughs> nodding while he's pacing around the ring looking at the crowd like, oh, Is your game? Is your game? <laughs> now, listen, you could call Adonis a lot of things right now. Vengeful, a loser, spaghetti for brains. But one thing bitch. you can't call him is a bitch. Because yes. he beat the count and stood back up ready to get back to it. And you can't lie, that's admirable. Bro's the bravest punching bag of all time. The <laughs> thing is, bravery without skill to back it up is pointless. So Creed jabs, then throws a left and gets countered, getting hit twice in the same spot. Oh, damn. damn! Dropping down to his knees. His ribs are absolutely shattered. Yep. Look at the way his legs buckled. Drago got this man hit in the cookout table. <laughs> and you think that's it. That was the final strike that ended the fight. But nah. Nope. While on the ground, yelling in pain, he somehow managed to muster up the strength to stand back up. With goddamn broken ribs, he still decided to opt in to continuing with the fight. I can't believe it. Adonis got the durability of Trippy Red. <laughs> yeah. Trippy going certified paper plate so often that he be dropping is remarkable. <laughs> but it's not just me. Nobody watching the fight anywhere could believe it either. 
If Creed pulls off this win, it'll be up there with LeBron's 3-1 and Tom Brady's 28-3 comeback in the Super Bowl. Hmm. Blocking one, but getting hit in the same spot, needing two more, but manages to leave and return with one of his own. The bell rings, that's the end of round two. The ref interjects, and Donnie is talking his shit. Yeah, hmm. what's up? You balled with the hairline. How that work? Stop playing with me. I'm like that. <laughs> Adonis is beyond just having that dog in him, but at this rate, he's gonna be dead or sounding like Darth Vader for the rest of his life when he tries to breathe. Hmm. I'm calling the fight. Man, don't call that shit! Dog, look at you. I'm good, hmm. just put a band-aid on it. Poor Rocky, his heart can't take this anymore. Target to hmm. the TV telling them to call the fight. The war flashbacks busting his ass of when Apollo Creed told him not to call the fight, and it resulted in his death. Give him that he chose to pull a Krillin versus a strong enemy and sit <laughs> this one out, so there's nothing he can do. Ultimately, the substitute coach lets Adonis continue with the fight. Looks into the crowd, sees Adonis' girl, and gives her the shoulder shrug like, Shit, what you want me to do? <laughs> you might have to start downloading Tinder real soon, shorty. At this point, Drago's just trying to end it. His pops is out here calling him an embarrassment, even though he's dominating the fight. She blocks his right left and weaves the next two, but gets cracked in the ribs. This shit is turning into a kick stream. It's getting hard to watch. <laughs> Bianca's on her feet. Rocky is screaming at the TV to stop the fight. Alzheimer's got him in a chokehold. They can't Damn. hear you, Unc. Creed with his back against the ropes again, gets hit with another rib shot, leaves the right, block, and has him swinging on the air. But Draco hits him with the IQ play, pulling out a pump fake from his bag, faking the jab to the hand, and catching him in the ribs one last time as Creed falls to the ground. And while he's hitting the will you marry me, Draco <laughs> comes over, winding up, and delivers the most ridiculous oh. uppercut I've ever seen, putting his ass straight to sleep. The thing is though, is that bro, you cannot do that. When a fighter has one knee down, you aren't allowed to strike them. So that meant that Drago was disqualified on the spot. Creed remains the champ. But when we see him after the fight, he in here looking like he got ran over by a fucking truck. Rocky comes to visit him, but Adonis is tight at him for leaving him to go out there by himself, hmm. so he kicks him out the hospital room. The beatdown was so bad, after he was dismissed from the hospital, Creed couldn't even walk himself home. Bro nope. was in a wheelchair. But of course, months passed, and Drago's out here destroying other fighters while calling out Creed on national TV, telling him that he better run it back because he got a Mickey Mouse ass win last night. <laughs> so Creed and Rocky make up over a game of 2K, Rocky raging about how Steph Curry's not even like that, and agrees to trade him for the rematch against the fucking as guardian that is Drago, which they spent months doing, and now it's time for the fight. Creed agreed to pull up to Drago's hood this time, so they're fighting in Russia. He got his trainer Rocky there. He came in this bitch dressed like the Grim Reaper <laughs> with his mom and girl in the crowd this time. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you, gang. You're simply just not allowed to lose now. Yeah. You can't bring the really whole now and end up on the mat hitting the bow and arrow again. It's <laughs> time for the face off and damn, <laughs> did he get taller? He, he, he looked taller somehow. There's so much static that even Rocky and Drago looking at each other like they ready to run it back. Y'all unks need to relax. You had your time to shine already. <laughs> oh, by the way, I know they had a deleted scene with Creed too when both Drago and Creed, I'm um, the Creed, Rocky actually fought in the building. They had, um, it's actually a deleted scene. They should have put it in the movie. Dang, that was such a good fight. Fighters go to their corners and receive some pep talk with their coaches. Rocky gives them some Wait. motivation. He you said your mom would smell like hot dog water and beat ass. <laughs> By the way, it's actually in the bill, not in the Boston ring they both fought, but yeah, it was a great um, deleted scene, man. And Creed looks into the crowd, nodding at his girl while she's showing up her set. <laughs> well, Creed is ready. He looking at Drago like, There's no way out of this one. You're done. You're done. <laughs> the bell rings and Creed dodges Drago's quick left to right, getting two of his jabs blocked. They're circling around the ring, and right here, Donnie shows that he's a whole new fighter. Throwing the jab and getting countered. His girl is already yelling, she's nervous seeing him hold that, but he ate that shit. Look at him, he's good. Come on, man! That's the way! That's the way. That shit had Drago scooped. Look at his face. Even his pops had to remind him, bro, keep swinging. After Drago remembers that he is indeed still in a boxing match, they trade jabs as the hands are right, and they take turns putting on a Weed Nation tryout. Yes. Donnie ducking the left, missing his own left, then hit him with the hit. Yes. <laughs> this fight is straight, guns blazing from the start. Shit got Unk in the crowd sweating bullets. Somebody get me my carrot juice. Creed jabs twice to the head and then goes for two body shots. Creed then goes ahead and activates his shotgun, being able to read that a hook is coming, returning with a filthy 
four piece combo. Hmm. Drago can't believe how fast Queen has improved in such a little time. Look at his face. Ain't nothing on your nose. <laughs> hey, Adonis might be a saying and caught that Zenkai boost. You know how sick I'd be if I stabbed him again and he came back 15 times more powerful? <laughs> Creep those two jabs and gets hit with a right, blocks two rights to the rib cage. He clearly remembers having to roll himself everywhere after getting his ribs turned to dust in the first fight, <laughs> but gets caught blocking himself into the ropes, leaving another one. And I haven't seen this level of evasion since Nick Cannon versus Consistent Fatherhood. Ultra Damn. instinct type movement. Damn. Duck, deflect, duck, duck, duck. <laughs> right, left. That's why he's the goat! Stupid. The, the goat! goat. <laughs> this is a whole new fighter. Girl. He moving like a serial cheater. I'm not the same man I was four days ago. <laughs> oh, oh shit, dude. Let's get it. Drago misses the left and catches a mean right. Yeah. Right now, the round is very close. Both of them have dosed out very similar levels of CTE. Nobody has pulled away yet. So Kree starts passing to close out the round. Block, counter. Both of them getting in each other's faces after the bell rings. Oh yeah, this is the energy I love from both fighters. Especially from Creed. Like I said, they in Russia. Drago got the home court advantage, even though Creed is still the champ. It takes a lot to be talking your junk when everybody in the crowd is against you, yelling yourself some creative slurs. Motherfuckers will turn into Shakespeare when it's time to be racist. I know the crowd crowd boom you. They all in here chanting watermelons. You realize you're allergic to it. And you all that hate, all that noise. You have Bianca in the crowd talk about how she's gonna put it on you if you win. I need that, Unc. I know you do, nephew. So go out there and win this fight. And I just want everybody to notice, bro was getting coached by his mouthpiece operator in the first fight. He was doomed from the start. <laughs> the bell rings and round two starts. Donnie blocks two, gets me, then keeps the left. Of course, Draco's dad was in the huddle telling him straight villainy. Tom Bossom, you better drop him. So he's swinging crazy. Rib shot, heavy left, but then goes over for in the next few minutes. This is how Drago looked trying to find a critical strike right now. Your opponent has UI. Creed jabs, <laughs> blocks, right, left. Even Victor had to shake his head like, yeah, you rocked my shit. He's being pushed to his limits and his dad's still out here just yelling. Turn it up. He like, bro, that's the match. That's the match, that's the match. Drop up goes to left, right, gets blocked. Mm -hmm. and hammers Ooh. left, block, block, uppercut. Look at his pop's face. His ass is cheesing at the idea of the man he killed, son, getting killed too. While Rocky's giving him that Kobe stare from across the ropes. <laughs> Creep clinches, but eventually gets thrown off into a wrist shot chin tap. At this point, Donnie could recite to us exactly what the ceiling looks like with the amount of time he spent staring at it. Drago jabs right left into a disgusting oh. way. That hole looked like it gave him whiplash. The <laughs> same jump that got Gwen Stacy looking up Damn. at Peter Parker living the rest of his life now. Damn. He eats it, clinches again, but then just gets tossed to the mat. Donnie looking at him like, are you serious right now, bro? <laughs> and as if that wasn't enough, Drago runs up and puts his dick on my man's forehead. That's so OD. But he's not trying to get disqualified again, so Creed stands up and is good to continue on. Drago damn near sprints out his corner and hits Donnie with a left right hook, knocking his ass right back down. Damn. He got him hitting push-ups on his fist. Yeah. Creed just needs to take a moment and breathe. As long as he gets up before the count gets to 10, he's good. Stay down, little nigga. Don't get up until you gets to eight. Three. Unk, his head is probably spinning. I don't think he knows what number eight comes before or after anymore. Look at Bianca's face. She knows she's gonna have to put every meal in a blender with the straw for him at this rate. But Creed listens and gets up on eight count. Rocky tells him, yo, just tie Drago up. Don't get hit because the round is about to end. But Creed doesn't listen to him and ends up getting pieced up to end the round. These two, for real, don't like each other. But based on the way the round finished and the knockdown that Drago had on Creed, Drago easily won round two, currently putting the fight at a 1-1 score. Was that picture of B. Jordan if he was young? He was in um, The Wire, play Wallace. <laughs> if we use that picture, that picture he's young. Now you're doing That's good, crazy. Man. I mean, you're fighting a fucking Avengers villain in there. <laughs> keeping up. Remember what Kobe told Kanye, though. Are you a different animal, but the same beast? What the f*** does that mean, Kobe Bryant? <laughs> You walk. <laughs> I don't know what Kobe was talking about. All right, Pete, go right. That you got that wolf in you. Go out there, eat up. 
Dementia busting Unk's ass. He's speaking in straight hieroglyphics. But I guess Creed understood it because the fight continues. And he hits him with a right, left, body shot, left, hits the chin check, rib shot, and a filthy uppercut. Mm. Drago got Creed hitting a step back into the ropes, but he manages to eat the right, duck out the way, and return with the right of his hand. Mm. While Drago got his head cut by somebody calling his name, Creed feels his face, notices that he's cut, and that shit hikes him up even more. Drago been spamming that wild ass left all fight, so Creed reads it, ducking under, winding up, and unleashing a deadly right straight to the jaw. Got his set particles flying everywhere. <laughs> Unk in the crowd, hype as hell, relax before you catch a heart attack. That's the end of round three, and we move on to the start of round four, getting right to it. Creed beats the right, got him doing the lean back. Now lean back. Gets hit in the ribs once, who blocks the second, getting caught with the right, got his face bending like some bad animation. He's up against the ropes fighting for his life, blocks the rib shot, and the bell fucking rings, but he's still hitting afterwards. Damn. Yo, who the fuck would Creed talk to be the ref of this fight? It's literally just not allowed. Jeez. His girl Bianca is watching him get his back going out against the ropes, and Rocky's just like, yo, what y'all got going on? Round four ends, and now we're at the start of round five. Hmm. And this round isn't looking good for our boy Creed, because he's out here throwing jabs, and Drago just punches him with a double left, right left hook, getting another knockdown. Staring him down, too. That's gotta be racist. <laughs> but we know that Creed's jaw is made out of goddamn vibranium, so Rocky tells him to get his ass up, and of course he's able to do it. That's the end of round five, and they go back to their corners. <laughs> You're doing good, Donnie. Just remember to stay in close. He got those fucking Mr. Fantastic arms. Stay in close and eat him up from the inside. No pause. We zoom. Donnie's <laughs> no is in the scoring, so he's straight shooting threes to try to come back right now. Throwing a two piece, getting his neck shot blocked. He eats that. <laughs> The Russian crowd is straight crickets right now, except for the three people Creed pulled up with. And Drago looks terrified that his pops is gonna leave to go get the milk. With the Damn. Pieces. I imagine Victor be at home telling his dad I love you and Ivan just like, fuck you! So he tries desperately to get back but ends up getting counted. But hey. not just that, he's even cut. These boys are in an absolute dogfight right now. Both of them finna go home with swollen heads the size of sheen. <laughs> now we're at the start of round eight. Creed hooks, and he listened to what Rocky said because he gets in close for a left-right weave to the ribs and uppercut. He's straight surgical right now. We need him versus the GOAT. Floyd Mayweather finna call him out next. I was watching this fight last night. I remember reading his name. What was it again? A bonus cred? A bonus cred. A bonus cred. Oh god. Into a left hook that blocks both jabs right left, Ooh. making his ass check both ways before crossing the street. That got the crowd going crazy. Even mom out there getting lit. The time is running out of the round though. So Creed moves out the way of the right hand and returns with a nasty right left. Drago can't believe what's happening right now. After the bell, Creed stand his ass down. Bro stumbling backwards looking like this nigga is crazy. Victor <laughs> Drago sits down and of course Ivan has given him another diabolical green goblin ass speech to try to break his ribs again because he can't go band for band with Creed like this. Victor being desperate for a hug from his daddy, of course he finna listen, so watch this bullshit. <laughs> he leaves and hits him with the left, sidesteps out the way, hold that. He goes for another left, and Drago literally grabs his fucking arm, which isn't allowed, his right? ass is future, he cannot stop cheating, hitting him in the ribs Ooh. twice, knocking him to the mat, breaking his rib cage again. The ref is literally right there and doesn't right. give Drago any point deduction. <laughs> they it. had to have slipped him the meanest 50k before the fight because what the hell is this? He even had the nerve to start flexing on him while he's on the ground fighting for his life. I can never imagine someone about to dunk the ball. I snipe him and start like talking that. about, I'm like that, no easy buckets. But he <laughs> manages to stand up. This man has no quit in him and the round ends. They both go back to their corners and Rock is asking him what's wrong. Is it your ribs? Nah, it's his knee. Yes, it's his knee, <laughs> Creed is in so much pain he can't even speak to answer him. So at this point, they're all pretty aware of what happened. His ribs are broken again. So Rocky looks at him like, what you want me to do? You want me to call the fight? Creed, despite being unable to speak, lifts up his head and the look on his face says it all. And that's when Rocky responds with, I didn't think so. And he starts game really planning to creep what's about to happen. How Drago's gonna start cheesing rip shots to break on them even more. But he tells him it's okay because you like the pain, no Rihanna. Cause I like the way it hurts. <laughs> he tells him you can handle it though. Oh, that song though. I'm dangerous. I'm dangerous. That's what it is. 
That's some motivational ass shit right there. Hell yeah. Probably could get me to go in the ring versus Jiren with those words. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the other corner, Ivan Drago is telling Victor that if you don't finish Creed, I'm out skis. And I don't want <laughs> Out skis. So they both get up from their corners, the bell rings, and it's go time. Who wants it more? Drago's moveset is more predictable than a new Call of Duty game. So he <laughs> instantly goes for the ribs, but Creed dodges it and returns with a nasty right-left combo. But Victor's a crackhead though. He's speeding for that rib shot. Block and misses, but lands it, gets his next two block, but lands another one. Rocky's on the sideline and yells out to Creed to wrap him up, get him a clinch, but he doesn't even get the chance. Cause Drago unleashes another body hey. shot into a left, knocking him to the mat. His girl and his mother gasping for air. She looked like she ready to hop and ring and hit the. <laughs> He's a. Did I catch you having fun? so much pain he can't hear anything everyone's telling him to get up but nothing's coming through bro can only hear the sound of his rib cage crackling but there's one person he's able to hear and that's the love of his life in the crowd on some straight high school musical shit rose the star of the team and his girl in the nosebleeds she gotta be the side chick i'm just saying <laughs> Creed, motivated by her, starts pounding the hell out the mat, somehow, someway, able to find the strength and rise back up, holding onto his ribcage, ready to keep on going. Drago's in disbelief, got his hands on his hip like, Really, nigga? <laughs> Just stay down! <laughs> There's no way you gotta fight with half your ribcage gone. The ref comes over and as part of protocol, he has to make sure he's okay to keep fighting by asking him what's his name. Creed! This right here is Cinema. cinema. There's yep. no matching of energy you can do to that. Drago's in the other corner trying his best like ah! <laughs> So the fight continues and with one goddamn arm on his Sasuke Uchiha shit, Creed is giving him straight business, eventually getting into the clinch with him, and uses this time to take advantage of his T-Rex arms in comparison to the nine-footer he's fighting. Starts unloading straight body shots into Drago's impact. There's no amount of sit-ups that can protect you from this pain. His big ass is gas. Look at him trying to rest on top of Creed's shoulder to catch his breath. Pitching <laughs> ass softly, hitting him with a right left. Using his left arm to measure the space, making sure to get the angles right. And loads up a disgusting right, sending him straight to the mat. The whole crowd is going bonkers, hype as hell, which is crazy. Wasn't y'all just rooting for bro? This switch up is nuts. We got this man on the ground hitting planks. Drago manages to beat the count at six and get back up. Bianca and Mama Creed looking like, What? Yeah, seriously, man. God, 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 God. He ain't gonna give up. God, God. But Creed is ready. He got the eye of the tiger and is locked in. Look at him compared to the way Drago came out of his corner. That punch unplugged his brain. The way he stumbled his ass out here, I would think the ref would call it. But nope, y'all clearly ain't bribe him enough because he allows Drago to go out there and catch him right and left. His dad in the crowd shaking his head in disappointment as Creed weaves body shot left to right, gets him up on the ropes and unleashes two more body shots on him. Rocky in the crowd being a true unk, mimicking the moves and shit, looked back at some lady like, yeah, I told him that back when he was mad little. Drago <laughs> continues to get his ass beat for some shit his dad did though, as he ducks under his two body shots on the left. <laughs> the crowd is ready for him to end this fight, but Drago with the will of just wanting to play a game of catch with his pops is refusing to go down. Beating <laughs> the left, but not just one, eating another left, uppercut hook, <laughs> and finally he falls down to the ground. The crowd starts going crazy, everybody's juicing, hype as hell, and then the cameraman pans to her. This Walmart Ellen DeGeneres is <laughs> Walmart Ellen DeGeneres. DeGeneres. her son and his father mad long ago. Yeah, so did. Way, just to see him get his ass beat. And as if that wasn't bad enough, Shorty just gets up with her new man and dips. Yeah, and like, dips, yeah. The fight not even over. The ref only counted to three so far. Drago's like a bumbling idiot, is fighting for his life to stand up, and peeps that her chair is empty. <laughs> Drago already lost one parent, and he doesn't want to disappoint another, so he grabs onto the ropes and stands up, but he's clearly <laughs> out of it. Based on the looks of Ivan Drago and Rocky's face, they both know what's about to happen. Yep. Victor Drago is about to die in there. He can't keep going like this. I'm Michael Jordan. <laughs> Stop, Stop it. it. Get some help. Get some help. Creed still with one arm to block Drago's left <clears throat> and counters. Drago unable to stand up straight starts moonwalking backwards as he <laughs> ducks out the way and counters the twice. He's so tired up anymore just straight up falls on creed and instead of letting him hit the map bro said get off me and unleashes another three-piece combo on his ass ivan drago in there watching his son deadass be killed and this terminator ass nigga actually shows some emotion for yep. once looking like he's ready to cry bro's out here crying like damn this is bad someone should probably stop this fight 
As if he cared. <laughs> he hits him with a right, then a body shot, got him up against the ropes, duck under his hook, right, left. Even Bianca and Mama Creed like, oh no, nah, this is OD. <laughs> He's already dead. He's already dead. I think we ain't doing <laughs> it. Right, left, Nancy, still going. Draco Damn. tries to fight back, but the air is in your opponent, gang. Swinging an uppercut and completely missing. Ivan Drago recognizes that this fight is over, and he doesn't want what happened to Apollo Creed to happen to his son. Swallows his yep, pride and throws towel. Meaning that this time, fair and square, no Mickey Mouse as W, Creed <laughs> remains the heavyweight champion of the world. Mm, God dang. Wow, that was a whole recap. Wow, that was an amazing recap. This one, y'all, this one, your best vids recap. Recap vids, Blank Boy, definitely was. Woo wee. Damn, man. That was that was an intense fight. That was a hell of a tense fight, though. I ain't gonna lie. When I first saw it, I was like, God damn, man. After all the beating um, Drake, um, Victor Drake was getting from Creed, it was like, oh my God. Like, bro, freaking throw the towel, Ivan. Like, come on now. That, that, that was so brutal to watch. That, that was intense to watch, man. Jesus Christ. But overall, W Blake Boy recap, man. Keep up the great work as always. This is one of your best recaps, man. Keep up the great, great work. So, Hot Squad, that was my conclusion of Blake Boy's Creed to recap. So, if you enjoyed this, please hit that like button. Comment and share your thoughts. How many times have you seen Creed? If you've seen the entire trilogy? And what is your favorite Creed movie? Of course, um, the first Creed is, my, is going to be my favorite. And what's your favorite Rocky movie, actually? So, yeah. Overall, W recap, Blake Boy. W recap. So, Hot Squad, is now time for Cool 09 recap of Spider-Man 2. In a couple of moments, I got to get some water. I am thirsty. So, Hot Squad, I will see y'all in a few moments, so please stay tuned for that.